Alright, so we're gonna go, uh, give this El Cheapo uh, car jump starter pack. It's pretty much just a battery pack, slightly bigger than one you might have for your phone. Uh, it was about $30 on eBay. Comes with various things, uh, in-car charger, various ports for laptops and things like that. Uh, the jump drive, uh, it's got little emergency things there, four USB ports so you can charge your phone, various voltages, uh, 19 volts uh, for laptops and things, but the one we're going to use is the 15 volt one, which is going to be for our car. When you have a running battery on a car, it does actually measure around 14 volts, so even though it does say a 12 volt battery on it, go figure, huh? So um, on this battery pack, there's a little engine start tab right there, just going to take that off. And that should allow us to plug in our jumper cables. So as you can see, right there. So we're going to try and jump this 4.6 litre Mustang. It's a V8. Battery is totally dead. Let's give it a go. So this is what happens when I try and turn the key normally. Absolutely nothing. So what we do, connect positive to positive, negative to negative in that order. Go over here, switch it on using the switch. I've got a full battery, which is nice. And turn the key. <laughs> I have found that if your car is absolutely dead, you know, it's been sitting in a driveway six months, just leave it like this for like a minute, maybe two, and then try and start the car. Just like when you try and give someone a jump stop. So let's give it a try. And I'll leave the video rolling. All right, come on. Oh, 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 almost. All right, so that was a quick connect. Uh, I'm gonna give it two minutes now and try again. So this battery has been sitting, I think, eight months now, something like that. It's absolutely dead. It actually needs replacing. It measures at 1.6 volts right now. All right, I'm giving it about one minute, 30 seconds. Let's go back in the car. Let's see if I can do it this time. Check it out. Now that's not bad for $30 on eBay, is it?